happy to lend you a bra, but I don't think I have anything that would fit you. That's the Peter Pan. That'll smash him down good. But you'll never get those in there. I know. I just wanted to see what it would feel like to be your size. Are we doing like a boob Freaky Friday? Because I don't want to lug yours around. They're alone. I know. That's the whole point. That's why all the women in my family have back trouble, you know? Ugh. So now that I have insurance, so I was thinking maybe I could have like breast reduction surgery. No! I wonder who this is. What? It's a boob reduction, Schmidt. Just accept it. Acceptance is stage five. I'm grieving, CC. There are five stages of grief. Stage one was denial. This is not happening. Yes, this is. is not yes, happening. You're is. not getting yes, a boob I reduction. Am. This is yes, not happening. Is. Stage two was anger. Your breasts belong to all of us. Okay. Who are you to decide? Next will be stage four, depression. And then stage five, acceptance. But right now, I'm firmly planted in stage three, bargaining. Dear God, okay. if you stop Cece's breast reduction, I'll circumcise Coach. Now, this is just a consultation, so do your best to relax. Okay. Stop the surgery! This is just a consultation. May we have the room, please? That's what it's here for. I'm sorry. What are you doing? Okay, look, I know I can't stop this, and I accept that, but I just wanted to stop it long enough so that I could say goodbye. Oh, look. This is a low-risk procedure, okay? I'm gonna be fine. Oh, you meant say goodbye to my boobs. I forgot who I was talking to. No, Schmidt, you cannot see my boobs. I need to look them in the eyes. I can't let them leave without knowing how much they've meant to me. I'll let them know. No. I need to tell them myself. <sighs> all right, okay. You can say goodbye to one, all right? I mean, j just one? One. <sighs> Gosh almighty. The ultimate Sophie's Chocho. I mean, there's Harold, he's just full of life. Ugh. And Kumar, who's shy. Who's shy, but yet surprisingly so brave. But, you know, who wouldn't be with a best friend like Harold? Oh my God, fine. You can say goodbye to both, okay? Okay, I need you to put these on. What? This is a private conversation that doesn't concern you. The playlist matches the mood. I guess if I'm being honest, it doesn't matter what size you are. I'm always gonna love you because you're attached to the most beautiful person in the whole world. <laughs>